Hello, I'm Sig Solo. Welcome to my channel. I went to, welcome to SS slash SE September number eight. So the final shave. And today's racer is a race I've been waiting for all September because it's the Carp Overlander stainless steel with the four inch handle. I just got it in at the final moment to make this shave. Thank you, Chris, for making this. And thank you, Chris, for getting it to me. The Carp Overlander stainless steel. In it, I have the Viking sword by Persona made in Israel. And it has one dot here, so it will be the second shave with this blade. The so for today is this. It's a sample that Pete from, from Hendrix Classics and Company sent to me, and it's the Mafia the Canadian. Mafia, Canadian Mafia Shave Soap. So this great sample I'm using today. Also, I'm using this wonderful uh, ebony handled uh, fork or uh, boti brush. And the Hendrix Classics and Co. ball that I was very kindly sent from Pete. There you had them. Okay, so let's get this shave started. But before I do so, I want you to see this. Because as I was waiting for this racer, I thought, well, I can do odd one out uh, oct uh, October shave number two with the Blackland Blackbird racer. And I accidentally during the shave did this motion here and got this. So that's why you see this little mark here, if you see it at all. And if you don't, good. So remember to look in on the 4th of October to see the odd one out October number two, because that's where I use my special edition Blackland Racer. So in case you're wondering, oh, this is a nice scented soap. This soap is, um, Jean-Paul Gaultier, uh, La Malle, Le Parfum. So that's it. So let's see, can I get this? Oh man, that's nice. This is Boti's most soft brush. And I feel that, man, that's nice. Man, man, man. Chloe contacted me from Boti and said, pick any brush you would like. Pick two brushes if you want to, and I said I don't care which brush I get, but or what handle I mean, just as long as it is, is it is the softest knot you have. And this one is it's made from the best part of the back hair. They are rarely used because it takes a lot of skill and a lot of effort to put it into a brush. I'm told. If it's true, I have no idea. But I can tell you, this is softer than anything I've tried, and I've tried a lot. Okay, so 113 grams, uh, four inches, blade gap 0.73, and exposure uh, 007 millimeter, so very little. Okay, let's get this party started. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is what I have been waiting for. When I first did the Forbidden Moves shaves with the brass version of this, I think I said in the video, or at least I thought, I hope this comes in a stainless steel version. And then I contacted Chris and he said, down the line, this razor will be available in stainless steel. The soap I'm using, this, of course, 
a sample. of the soap, what I tell you. As far as samples go, this is extremely strong. I would say it's a... seven out of 10. I just needed to focus here upon the mole. I feel the blade a little, but only a very little, so all is good. Let's get this. Oh man, look at this. Look at this sheen, man. That's nice. <laughs> oh man. Pete's soap. This is made by Pete's Hendrickson. Pete's Hendrix. Sorry. Hendrix Classics and Co. Uh, so that's his top shelf base with tosser silk and goat milk and all the very expensive butters. So you know it's good stuff. And this is and the scent on this. Is it too strong? Nope. No such thing. No such thing as a soap that's too strong, I think. This was a two and a half day stubble. <coughs> Tastes like soap. <laughs> okay, let's give this a go. This feels like a B or a C plate on the Christopher Bradley. But the efficiency, I'm told, I read somewhere, that the efficiency is like a D plate almost. So, only use the D plate once, I think. I hardly ever use that. But I did that with my Canadian limited edition. I used the D plate and I got a great shave. So, whatever. I'm usually a C plate man. So, if you're contemplating getting this, follow my link below and put your name on the pre order wait list because this was sold out first batch was sold out in 10 hours. I ordered this 45 seconds after the release. So that's when I got my confirmation mail. 12 o'clock noon and 45 seconds. So I was sitting there waiting couple of weeks ago. Man, this is a nice racer. And that reminds me with the Bochy brush. Follow the link below and add the 6 Solo 71 code and get a 10% off. Okay, let's have a feel here. Oh, a little under the nostril there. As always. That's because I'm more focused on talking and on shaming. Because this flat head is easy to get under the nostril, under the nose, under the snout. Let's feel down here. See, that's the old wound from the other day. I have some stopple down here. I know you're thinking why do you keep going down there if you have all the bumps? Well, still need to shave it, right? So, let's feel this. Oh yeah, that's it. Wonderful razor. Hmm.
So that was a very short pickup and that's it. We are done with the shaving part of the shave. So, and I just managed to cut myself there. <laughs> but you know, I had a little bump under the nose because I have a tendency to get an ingrown hair here and one here. So I have to cut that from time to time and I did so today. Hendrix Classics & Co. Towel. And so what would we expect in this then? So that's it. The Arthur Shave is the Gold Power Colony one from Arco. I know. Oh yeah, there's a burn. And then I sent. It's not. It's not completely there. With, uh, with the, 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 the parfum, the lamel parfum, but it's very close to being there. Let me just use the alum stick there. Okay, you know, a very nice scent. And this is seven dollars for how much? Looks like half a liter. It's not 250 milliliters for seven dollars. This, uh, the Noxima Classic. After shave balm, and this contains vitamin E and hyaluronic acids. So a lot of good stuff for your face. And also it has a light, a nice citrusy scent. So it's a good way to finish any shave, I think. Very inexpensive too. I think I paid five pounds for it in shaving time. So. That's it. Let's hear if, it, if the face is in tune. So there you have it. It was a great shave. Thank you, Chris, for making this. Thank you, Booty, for sending me the brush. Thank you, Pete, for sending me the soap and the shaving bowl. That's it. I almost forgot. <laughs> like, subscribe, hit the bell and share. And you know why we do this? We do this because we are not obsessed. We are dedicated. Six holo, out.